Hey family, how are you? Welcome back to It's a Family Thing. We know that you guys are going to be so excited about this next episode because it's absolutely off the chains. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for the next guys, episode. how are you? I am here watching Steve Harvey <laughs> and editing and doing laundry. I'm finishing up laundry because I have my blankets that I'm washing. So... I'm, wa I'm washing my blankets and I'm editing some videos so that they can go up today I have my husband's videos to edit I have I have about eight videos of his to edit and put up on his channel and then I think I have about two for the family channel so got a lot of work to do and Michaela's in the bathroom doing her nails she's painting her toes and her fingers <laughs> So, you guys like what I did with my hair today? I wanted to do something different. I just have like a little head scarf that I use as a headband and I kind of just tied it in the back. So, I just wanted to do something different. So, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are having a fantabulous morning. I hope everything is going well. <laughs> um, and yeah, I mean, I really don't have much that I'm doing today. Just catching up on housework and well actually I did that yesterday I cleaned the house yesterday but I wanted to try to paint my husband started painting the basement so I wanted to try to finish painting the basement and the basement floors get some carpet going on the steps and um, I wanted to finish off the floors in the house so I have quite a few stuff that um, projects that I'm trying to finish up before I have to go back to work again because you know for, for those of you who don't know the case that I was on, the family, the daughter is moving back, so she's going to be taking care of her mom, so my services, well, my company's services was no longer needed, so um, they're in the process of finding me something now, so I'm home today, and I don't know what tomorrow's going to bring, but I trust God. <laughs> we, um, I gave Michaela some work to do, so she's finishing it up. I wrote her name for her, I traced, um, I did some tracing so she could trace over it and then for her to write it on her own and she knows her numbers but I don't know if she has like number recognition, if she knows really what they look, she does know what some of the numbers are but I just wanted to make sure that you know she does know it and then trying to teach her some new words because she knows the animals, she knows all of that stuff but I just wanted to, you know, she started school in September, so I want her to really know things that she's supposed to know. And she really knows a lot. She's extremely smart, so she really is ahead of the game. Um, but, you know, I just liked her to brush up on some things. And while she was here with her dad, her dad was, they were doing homeschooling all the time. So I just wanted to keep that going, you know, so that she does not regress or anything like that. Um, but... Yeah, so that's what we're doing. We ate breakfast, and I'm, I'm still a little hungry, though, because all I had for breakfast was eggs and three strips of bacon, so I don't know if that can, that's not really holding me, but I didn't have any bread. I'm trying to cut out bread, you guys, out of my diet. Not for good, because I'm a bread eater, but try to cut it down, because I would eat, I could eat bread, like, every single minute of the day. So I'm trying to cut it down to at least two or three times a week that I eat bread. If I eat it in the morning, then I won't have it in the day in the, for the rest of the day. So I'm really trying to cut it down, watch what I eat. I'm going to start doing my exercising again, you guys. Treadmill is up. So I'm going to I'm gonna work it out, you know what I mean? So just wanted to say hi to you guys. Hope you guys are having a fantabulous morning. And yeah. You guys, look at Michaela's nails. She did her nails. I hope you I hope you did not get nail polish on my floors in the bathroom. I did. Okay. I got I got the, the teeny tiny pinch. But I'll be able to clean it off. Okay. Just not a lot of it. Just not a lot of it. <laughs> She's such a real girl, right? She's a girly girl. I'm glad she's a girly girl. Hey guys, how you doing? 
Ah, uh, it's hot outside. It's hot. Today has definitely been a day. It's 327. I'm making some some um actually I'm not making anything. I'm kind of I'm warming up the leftovers from last night's dinner. And my nail is itching like underneath it. I don't know why, but it's it's itching so bad. I don't know what that is, but maybe it's dry. Mm, I don't know. But got the kids from school and everything and we're just chilling out. They're upstairs. Mike is playing his games and Mikhail is playing her games and Nyla's just chilling out. She's sitting in the laundry basket playing with her bobos. And I just came downstairs because I want to get them get them some food to eat, but it just feels so good down here, guys. It's nice and cool. I got the fan on. And it's quiet. But I hear pitter patters. Little pitter patters. Yeah, so I'm just hanging out. Hey guys, good morning. Happy Fantabulous Wednesday. How are you guys doing? Today is a half day for my kids. I don't know if any of you guys, if your kids have half days because it's, it's um, the last day of school. Well, tomorrow is the last day of school, but they have a half day today and they have a half day tomorrow. Mommy, so, can you help me put it back, please? Okay. I'm going to get something to drink. Leave it there. So it's a half day, so they get out at 11. So I'm on my way, Mikhail and I, we're on our way to go get Mikey now from school. It's 1048. So on my way to go get them, go get Mikey. But just wanted to say hi to you guys. And, uh, Hi. How was your morning? Hope you guys are having a great day. Yes. And I feel the lemonade on the table by afternoon. Sorry. I am. Um, I am. I'm a little. I'm sleepy. I'm a little sleepy because I really didn't sleep last night. Like there was. I was getting all types of like attacks last night. Um, in my mind, you know. And so. It just was crazy. So I really couldn't sleep. So. I was up editing and praying and <laughs> and trying to go to sleep and finally I was I got up like after two because Mikey came into the room and said his throat was hurting him. Um, he was coughing a lot, so I gave him some water. Then he went back to sleep and then so I was up that whole time. So eventually, what I did, I just went into McKellar's room because <clears throat> I wanted Michael to get some sleep because I was moving around a lot and. I didn't want to wake him up, so I just went into Michaela's room and I fell asleep finally Ready. at 5.30. And I fell asleep at 5.30, but then I overslept because I didn't even realize it was after 6. And then I heard Nala goes, Mommy, Mommy. When I woke up, it was like 6.24. I was like, oh my gosh. But luckily, thank God, she was able to make the bus on time and and everything was okay. So she's on her way home. I'm going to go get Mikey now. So we'll see you guys when we get back. We're going to be late, Mommy. Hey, guys. Good night. How are you? Today's vlog was definitely non-existent. <laughs> um, today was... Today was a trying day for me. Uh, it was a good day, but you know, a lot went on today, um, and it was definitely rough. But the Lord got me through it. You know, I found out that. Um, a relative of mine got sentenced today to five years in jail and very close to him and I miss him so much you know and it just today was just a very hard hard day for me 
and you know other things that's happening with you know friends and family and you know but God is so good because even in the midst of everything that seems that is going wrong the Lord is restoring and you know you think that you're taking one step backwards and not so because your setbacks is actually setups for God to move in your life and to do something mega in your life so you know when the devil thinks that he has you in a chokehold the Lord just comes and releases you and you know show up and show out you know but the thing I love about God is that he never lies and he does what he say he's going to do and sometimes in our lives you, you it, it feels if you have hard times and it feels like you're getting that squeeze and it you know it feels like you're you're, you're choked by the the things that's going on in this world that's happening to you in this world but God is setting you up for greatness and I know that not just my immediate family not that not just my household but everyone that I love my friends and my family everyone that I love and care about I know that God is about and my household God is about to do something amazing he's about to do something amazing and so I'm happy and I'm excited about that nevertheless we're human and we feel pain and we feel, you know, disappointments and all different kinds of emotions. So you, you, you feel it and you have a right to feel what you're feeling and embrace it. But God is doing some amazing things in our lives. And, you know, while certain things may be happening other great things are happening you know and I feel like my family my immediate family and my extended family you know I feel like we're um we're closer than ever before and if life experiences is what it takes to bring family together then you know hey go through it and get through it and you know knock it out the park you know in life that's my motto is go big or go home in life like it's either you're gonna sink or you're gonna swim and I choose to swim I can't swim in real life but I will grab me a life jacket and I will swim or pedal or kick my way into destiny into my destiny and taking everyone that I can grab along with me and so you know, I just say this to say, I just say that to say this, to just be encouraged in that whatever you feel like you're going through in life, just know that there's somebody else out there that's going through something else, that you're not alone and you're not the only one. And that whenever something happens to you, it seems like it's an opposition. Just know that God's got you and that he's getting ready to load you down with the blessings of you know that he has for us and i just i just want to say you know just keep keep tracking keep keep going keep walking on the straight and narrow don't give up on god because he's never going to give up on you he's never going to leave you alone it may feel like you're there in the, alone but he's got you he's walking with you for sure you know so don't ever give up on him just trust him know that he knows what he's doing because he's God <laughs> and he's got us he's he's got us so I just want to say that certain things that happened today I I I I I'm not gonna say I didn't expect it but I didn't expect it to that extent you know but the Lord knows best and his will is perfect and if you're in his will then you know that you're going to be all right. But if you're not in his will, get in his will, you know. And, um, yeah, so I hope you guys had a wonderful day, a fantabulous day. Um, 
my head was hurting a little bit so because I was crying I was crying a lot today so I um I just went upstairs and lay down and Michael took care of the kids gave them baths and you know getting them to bed and stuff like that just so that I could lay down and rest my head because I was having such a bad headache you know but um yeah so hope you guys had a wonderful day and I'm so sorry that I didn't get more footage throughout the day I just I just I, I just wasn't feeling it because of the things that was happening throughout the day in my life so I apologize for that but you know sometimes I have to take the time to deal with the things that's happening in my life good and bad you know and you're not gonna be able to see everything on camera but you know there there are some things that I will let you know that's happening in my life because you guys are a part of us and you know we don't want to leave you guys out you know what I mean but we love you guys and we're not always you know on cloud nine or anything like that but we just we, we go through life just the way you guys do we feel we you know things happen set setups happen in our lives and we just take it in strides and just trust God and believe him because he's worked it out so many of the times before <laughs> So this is nothing for him to work out. But there's goodness that's coming out of all the craziness. <laughs> there's greatness that's coming out of all the chaos. So I just thank God. I thank God for today. I thank God for yesterday. And I thank him for the future. You know, whatever the future holds. He knows what, what, what it holds. And... Um, I'm just going to continue to trust him because that's the only way I know how and that's the only way I, I live my life is by faith and by trusting God and believing him and believing in his word. And hey, listen, it's blessed me so far. <laughs> you know, I was just sitting down thinking like, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm so blessed. And in, in no way or shape or form do I flaunt my blessings, you know, like to anybody or whatever but sometimes I just really sit down and I think about the great things that's in my life you know I'm I'm healthy I'm spiritually fit you know I'm wealthy <laughs> I'm wealthy yes I am I speak that in the name of Jesus <laughs> you know and um, I have a I have an amazing family I have a beautiful home and you know just a great business and, and life that's happening great life so I choose life and I choose to live life to the fullest and serve God while doing it <laughs> so you know um, I hope you guys are doing well and I hope you had a great day I hope you're having a great night as well and that you're loving the one that you with so if you like this video I know it's not a lot of footage today you know but give it a thumbs up and if you're watching for the first time there are so many other videos there that you can browse through and you know if you like those as well give them a thumbs up and if you like what we do if you like to hang out with our family on a daily basis you know just subscribe hit that subscribe button and um you know we're gonna be here so <laughs> you guys have a great night and Love the one that you're with. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. How are you? Thanks so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for being a part of what we do and what we create on a daily basis. We do it for you guys. <laughs> we love to do it. We have such a blast, and we absolutely enjoy it. So we um, we want you guys to comment and to you know subscribe. Tell tell everyone that you guys know. Share the videos with your family, with your friends, and you know just let them know that we're here. You know. We're here. We're here to stay. And we're having such a good time. We're having a blast doing it. So again, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, share, and comment. Y'all know y'all want to press that red button down there. You know you want to press that red button. Go ahead. Press that red button. Thank you guys so much for being a part of our vlogging family. And again, as always, have a good day.